In other news, another set of 68 students from a Katsina st uh, State um, are being sponsored by the state uh, to study degree programs on artificial intelligence and biotechnology in China. This is another strategic move by the state to remain relevant in the global arena and also open up more windows of opportunity to its youth. Abdul Kader Rasul reports. The global shift in transforming scientific research as well as everyday life from communication, transportation, healthcare and others can give a clear picture of what the world will look like in near future. Artificial intelligence is a wide range pool that enables people to rethink how they integrate information, analyze data and use the resulting insight to improve decision making. This set of students were selected from the 34 local government of the state and are being sponsored fully to study in China. In a farewell address to the student held at the government house, Katana, Dikko Umarada urged them to be good ambassadors and make the state proud. Governor Dikko Rada says the state selected the two courses based on the pressing needs in some critical sectors of the state. The scholarship package includes payment of their tuition fees, accommodations, health insurance, monthly upkeep, and book allowances apart from the traveling documents. We selected those courses based on present manpower need in some critical sector of the state. In this regard, the selection of artificial intelligence courses conform to the contemporary trend of information technology, where various aspects of women in the are now digitalized, including e-governance, innovation and creativity. Therefore, the artificial intelligence student on completion of the course will generally provide the needed manpower to the state government for the betterment of the life of the citizenry. Whereas the biotechnology students will make significant impact in transforming the agricultural sector, especially the high races. Musa Abubakar from the Musa local government and Hapsad Hamisu from GBA local government expressed gratitude to Governor Diko Umarada for the life-changing opportunity given to them. We, we extend our deepest appreciation for your exemplary leadership and dedication to the development of education in Kazina State. We gather as beneficiaries of your extraordinary kindness and generosity. We feel honored to have been selected from a pool of talented candidates and are ever ready to abide by the high standards and principles. Already, the students have arrived at their new schools in China. Abdul Latif Yusuf, TVC News, Kasulau.